I'm going to boot up XAMPP. I go to Start, All Programs, XAMPP, XAMPP Control Panel. And let me put this down here so you can see it. There's fun. Apache, MySQL. I click on Start for Apache. Then I click on Start for MySQL. You can see it started on port 80, Apache. MySQL starts on port 3306 now. Super duper great. Next thing I do, I go to Mozilla. And I key in, I key in localhost. And enter. Automatically this pops up. Localhost.xamp. I could have keyed in 127.0. In fact, I'll do that also, so you can see. One, uh, and to be in the address bar. I could have keyed in 127.0.0.1 and hit enter. And I'll come to the same place. So, 127.0.0.1 or localhost brings me to this place. This is where I want to be. I scroll up. Oh, I click over here on the left and hit the down arrow key till I get to PHP My Admin. Now, there's a lot of stuff on the screen, but I'm not showing it to you, so that I can show it to you in rather large letters, and you can see this for now. Click here, and I come to this funny window. Now, let me make this smaller so you can see the big picture. This is the PHP My Admin screen. I made it very small so you can see it. Now, well, so you can see the big picture. Now, let me make it a bit bigger, and you can see localhost 127.0.0.1, same, same. Here's PHP My Admin. You can make that bigger. And I got... These variables, databases, SQL, and more status, users, export, import, settings, and there's more down here. But as I make this bigger, it's easier to see it. It has more room to put this stuff in. It'll put it all on this tab here, rather than within more. So, lots of stuff we'll go over. This is basically how you get PHP, my admin, up on the screen. Let's close this down. Let me shut off the MySQL. Let me shut off Apache. And that's it for now. Bye-bye.